Hi students, this animation and description would help you to learn physics even more easier and better. So please do watch it and enjoy learning physics. Meter Bridge Meter bridge one of the form of Wheatstone's bridge. It consists of thick strips of copper of negligible resistance fixed to a wooden board. There are two gaps G1 and G2 between these strips. A uniform manganese wire AC of length 1 meter whose temperature coefficient is low is stretched along a meter scale and its ends are soldered to two copper strips. An unknown resistance P is connected in the gap G1 and a standard resistance Q is connected in the gap G2. A metal jockey J is connected to B through a galvanometer G and a high resistance HR and it can make contact at any point on the wire AC. Across the two ends of the wire, a Leclanche cell and a key are connected. Adjust the position of metal jockey or meter bridge wire so that the galvanometer shows zero deflection. Let the point be J. The portions AJ and JC of the wire now replace the resistances R and S of Wheatstone's bridge. Then, P by Q is equal to R by S equals R into AJ by R into JC, where R is the resistance per unit length of the wire. Therefore, P by Q equals AJ by JC equals L1 by L2, where AJ is equal to L1 and JC is equal to L2. Therefore, P is equal to Q into L1 by L2. Though the connections between the resistance are made by thick copper strips of negligible resistance and the wire AC is also soldered to such strips and a small error will occur in the value of L1 by L2 due to the end resistance. This error can be eliminated if another set of readings are taken with P and Q interchanged and the average value of P is found provided the balance point J is near the midpoint of the wire AC. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe this channel for more videos.